hello guys welcome back to just with dami if this is your first time here thank you for stopping by please do not forget to subscribe please subscribe to this channel and like comment share with friends and family don't just stop by subscribe thank you to my subscribers i want to say you guys are the real mvp Thank you so much for coming on this ride with me. I appreciate you for sticking through it with me up to this point. Let's do more. Let's continue to share, subscribe, comment, like, your like, your thumbs up. Actually make me want to do more. All right. Thank you for sticking with me. If you're new, this is a channel where we'll talk about real life experiences, lifestyle, food, vlogging, everything. So stick with me stay with me and let's continue this journey together today i'm going to be talking to my single ladies as you might have seen from the topic you see some of my single ladies need to wake up from their slumber they need to wake up from their dreams so today i am here to like ginger them you know make make them wake up make them see the worth in themselves okay so stay tuned and I'll be right back. gentlemen so my single ladies it is time for us to get into real business yeah yeah boyfriend what do i mean by yeah yeah boyfriend anyways why do you think girls have yeah yeah boyfriends why do you think ladies or girls you know allow themselves to be trashed in a relationship first of all yeah yeah boyfriend is a guy that does not respect you in a relationship he doesn't respect your time. He doesn't respect you as a person. He's not even there for you financially. He's not there for you to support you morally. Like, he can't be there for you. He can't help you out when you need him. That's a yeah, yeah, boyfriend. And you know what you do with yeah, yeah things. In case you don't know what yeah, yeah means, yeah, yeah means useless. And what do you think with things that are useless? You trash them. So, put yeah, yeah, boyfriends in the dumpster, not even trash can dumpster so my first point about yeah yeah boyfriends and you know why girls let themselves be trashed in a relationship is the fear of the unknown what do i mean by fear of the unknown girls feel like they don't know what is out there for them if they leave their present relationship my dear don't even have fears fear kills faster than anything in this world do not let fear control you i feel like there are three major things that a girl looks for you know in a guy in a relationship other than the physique right will be number one sex two financial assistance number three will be you know moral support just him being there that's number three so those three things if the guy is not giving you two like the financial assistance and moral support and all you're getting is sex my dear love it is high time you bounced you need to bounce out of that relationship because he he's not the only one that can offer you good sex really it's not the only one that can offer you that even though as a christian it's wrong for you to start having sex in your relationship before marriage yes i know but a lot of us are guilty of it we are just raise your finger up if you have not done it <laughs> may god forgive all of you that's the side now what i'm saying is that you know if that's the only thing, if sex is the only thing you're getting in that relationship, just bounce. He doesn't love you enough. He doesn't respect you. He doesn't take care of you. It is high time you left him alone. So a yeah, yeah boyfriend would just think I am going to go away and I'll be back and tell you, you know. Most times they don't even say I'm sorry. 
you know to just come back and still have that ego and all you do is just to let them do it over and over again one time mistake is acceptable repeated mistake is not an option that is no longer a mistake that is him rubbing it on your face that you are not good for him that is him telling you that you are no way a match for him so my dear love this high time you left him alone there are still 1001 good guys out there and there is one of them that is for you that is ready to take care of you ready to be for you ready to you know adore you cherish you so do not waste your time with this year year boyfriend in the name of love because that might be infatuation a year year boyfriend does not love you as much as you do because if he loves you as much as you do or more than you do he would not be a year boyfriend he would not be in that category of your year boyfriend so do not waste your time with a year boyfriend what you have to do the job that you have to do is to clear out the old things in your life the bible said it's right for old things are passed away so until you let the old things in your life those useless things in your life the trash in your life until you clear it out you would not have space for a new better thing and guess what like I said there is that one person waiting for you to take care of you to take you to you know the moon the cloud paradise as you want it that which you deserve there is somebody waiting for you please let him go he leaves you and go by and come back and tell you and tell you sorry and make you feel good and tells you sweet things but in a month time or two weeks or four weeks five weeks six weeks they're telling you again that you know we, I don't think we can work out my dear let him go don't entertain that BS anymore look yourself in the mirror and tell yourself I am gorgeous tell yourself I am good and there is somebody out there that want to take care of you it's an adage that says that you know if you have not visited another man's land you will think your father's land is the biggest you think that there is no one that can treat you better that's a lie it's a blatant lie okay there is somebody out there that wants to adore you that wants to really treat you right so please give the chance for something new in your life give the chance for something better in your life don't let anyone trash you don't let fear hold you down don't let fear control your life number two point is low self-esteem and what do I mean by low self-esteem so many girls just feel like you know they are not good enough so oh, because this guy is handsome because who oh, he has good body a lot of girls can have him you know he has many beautiful friends pretty girls and then you start feeling like oh you're not good enough for him wake up who told you that that's a lie you are gorgeous you're great you are marvelous you have a marvelous shape you have good personality you have everything nice honey you have everything great for you do not let anybody tell you otherwise if you're big you are bold tell yourself I am bold and beautiful I am big I am beautiful I don't care what anybody says it's your body you have to just treat it right so you don't let anybody treat you like a trash no way nobody should manage you do not let anybody have that satisfaction that joy of telling you that they're just managing you do not let that insecurity and low self-esteem trap you in a relationship that does not value you. It does not add any value to your life. Why stay with him? It's not worth it. My number three point is girls living in their fantasies. Why do, why do I say they live in their fantasy? They have this dream of how they could make the relationship work. Of how things could have been nice between them. Of how, you know how gorgeous they will look together be together be nice together have nice kids and all of that you're building your castle in the air honey wake up from your slumber wake up from that deep sleep stop daydreaming okay stop it stop helping him you know build something that he's not even ready to build 
He's not even in the picture. Stop. Do not let him continue to mess up with your life, to mess up with you, hurt you, and come back and tell you he's sorry as so many times, or not even say sorry, but you guys just get on. Stop looking for that Aurora story of how you guys got back together, and you know, you guys just click and just start living life, and you're living happily ever after. Stop it. If you want you, if you want it, let him put a ring on it. My single ladies, wake up and open your heart to the next good thing coming clear up your trash like clean it up throw them in the dumpster yeah yeah boyfriend throw them away he cannot offer you anything other than sex throw him away he does not value you throw him away he doesn't love you as much as you do throw him away listen to me that guy that is not treating you right if you leave him there is one girl that he's gonna come across that will have his momo button and you will wonder and you think to yourself like wait was that not the same guy i was with he has changed no he didn't change what has changed is that there is somebody with a key to his heart someone that he loves more in the relationship or maybe love as much as she loves him because if he loved you as much as you loved him or loves him, he wouldn't treat you like trash. It would not even belong to the category of yeah, yeah boyfriends. The only reason why he's there in the category of yeah, yeah boyfriends is because he doesn't love you as much as you love him. He doesn't love you more than you love him. That's why he's able to treat you like trash, you know, always walking out of your life and coming back in. That does the only explanation to it. Don't waste your time. There's no point. So, do you think you know more? Or you want to counter my opinion on why girls remain in a relationship where they are trashed? Please put your thoughts in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this topic. Let's help our single girls out there. Until next time, guys, I remain my humble self. And I'll see you in my next one.